In this video, we are going to go through one of the most important add-ons in Mythic Plus. This tool is used by almost every high-rated Mythic Plus player and allows them to coordinate every part of their kit together, timing keys they otherwise wouldn't have before, and is even super busted for LFG groups too. The add-on in question? Omni CD. And if you don't have it right now, go download it immediately. And sit back, because we will show you how to use Omni CD to its full potential, including a shortcut on setting it up before your next run. Speaking of which, if you are the type of player who wants to rank up fast this season, we're proud to announce that we've been developing brand new Mythic Plus guides for Season 3. We've been working with the highest rated players from Echo and Method to develop courses in one convenient location that teach you the advanced mechanics you can learn quickly that actually increase your IO score. Our guides teach you information you won't find anywhere else, like how to make your interrupts more effective, or how to take advantage of your entire toolkit to survive one-shot mechanics the right way. We even provide tests to help you fill any gaps in your knowledge and show you some of the most common damage mistakes that players just like you are making. With the help of MDI champions like Miris, you will learn everything that most players overlook. All this and more is contained in an expanding library of premium courses that are guaranteed to help you achieve your goals this season. In fact, we even promise that you will gain at least 500 rating while using our website, and if you don't, then you shouldn't pay. So visit the link below to get started with an exclusive discount offer. First off is the most obvious use, tracking your team's kicks and crowd controls. If you've ever wiped an M+, because of a deadly cast going off, you'll know how important interrupting the right spells are. With an add-on like OmniCD, these situations become far more rare as you can track everyone's kick in your group. If you see your team is using their kicks literally on cooldown and a huge priority spell is coming up, you can hold on to your interrupt to prevent the wipe. An excellent example of this is in packs with multiple casters, like the Millennia Threshold Trash in Galacron's Fall, where there's so many casts to kick. And if things like Tainted Sands or Enervate aren't dealt with, your group's going to take some huge damage. Another instance where tracking kicks can be invaluable is against the Ancient Protector's boss in the Everbloom, where you have to constantly ping pong between bosses to land kicks while dropping Noxious Discharge away from melee. Because of all the spells going through and movement from the charges, some high impact casts may potentially go through if your range players are kicking bolts on cooldown. This is where Omni CD can carry, as a melee or healer can see this situation happening in real time and use their gap closer to quickly charge over and cover the kick, preventing either a team wide stun or a large heal. Tracking kicks isn't only vital in pugs though, as it is a core feature of high-end pre-made Mythic Plus groups to have a shot caller to call crowd controls and interrupts. With this single add-on, coordinated players can easily deal with huge groups and chain stop casts with area of effect micro CCs like an incapacitating roar, dragon's breath, evoker knocks, and more. Which can be fantastic in the mobs who can only be dealt with by using crowd controls like the vicious snapdragons fixate in Thrones of the Tides. When it comes to offense, Omni CD can also help you increase your group's DPS, especially if you're playing a priest, augmentation evoker, or holy paladin, in order to line up major damage cooldowns. By tracking the CDs of your group, you can know exactly when to give or hold power infusion so both you and your teammate can get the most benefit, rather than just using it as it comes up, which although may work in an ideal world, will realistically not always line up with your pug's DPS cooldowns. This concept also applies to augmentation evokers as you can hold your breath of eons slightly to sync up with the rest of the group as to allow them all to get that huge damage increase together for maximum impact. Finally, as a holy paladin, it can help you pick which target to blessing of summer as well as knowing who will get their cooldowns back sooner with Blessing of Autumn. And if you really want to get creative, you could even give your Autumn to the augmentation so their Eons sync up better with other cooldowns, but this might require some quick math on the fly to see which target would benefit more. Moving on, tracking cooldowns with Omni CD can also be a fantastic asset for any tank player, regardless of their spec. This is because it can allow them to plan large pulls when they know their party have cooldowns available to melt the mobs. Just like this huge pull in the Everbloom before the Ancient Protector boss, which involves tagging the Twisted Abominations who deal massive damage with their Noxious Eruption. On the flip side, Omni CD lets tanks know when they need to do smaller recovery pulls if cooldowns are more limited. Without Omni CD available, tanks may not have the knowledge or confidence to go big, causing their dungeons to be short on time as they stick to the safest route. When it comes to defense, Omni CD can also be a lifesaver, allowing you to budget cooldowns according to what your group has available in several different ways. First off, it will allow you to track health potions or health stones, which allow healers to assign this as a scripted cooldown and call for potions when they know they do not have the throughput for a certain mechanic. This is a very common practice on Priestess Alunza in Atal Dazar in higher keys, 
where only using personals and relying on your healer isn't enough to live the transfusions. Instead, living one set of transfusions with walls and the next with health pots is the more efficient and safer play. Omni CD also allows the healer to know if cheat death effects like Defy Fate and Cauterize are on cooldown, allowing them to prioritize healing more vulnerable targets if the entire group is about to take party-wide damage, as well as letting them know what defensive cooldowns are available from their group so they can focus on doing more damage with offensive plays such as using Divine Toll and Daybreak for damage rather than healing. Tracking defensive isn't just for healers though, as it can alert DPS players to when they will need to use their walls. A class like Shaman, whose only defensive is on a very long cooldown, can hugely benefit from seeing if their healer has tools available to heal, allowing the Shaman to hold on to their only cooldown for when they really need it. Finally, with the help of Omni CD, you can become a better tank player for your team, not just by being able to plan larger pulls as we mentioned earlier, but by keeping up members of your party with your utility. See your healer doesn't have personals? Use that prot paladin sacrifice on them. Notice someone is missing their cheat deaths? Send out that rallying cry. See that your group is refusing to use wall on that huge incoming AoE? Hello darkness, my old friend. There are so many scenarios where Omni CD can save a pull, and by reacting to cooldowns rather than tunnel visioning health bars, you can really optimize your externals for your party. Now that we've covered all the benefits of Omni CD, we have to set it up. Or alternatively, you can join our Discord and import the code on the profile sharing tab to have it done for you. But if you want to do it manually, all you need to do is first install it from CurseForge. Then open up the options with the slash Omni CD command and navigate your way to the visibility tab and make sure dungeons are enabled. From here, we will then go to the dungeon dropdown on the left and hit enable, which will give us the add-on's own preset bars with everything in one place per player. Now, we recommend enabling show range to allow you to know if your teammates are potentially out of range with their kicks or are too far for you to react to them before going to the spells tab and clicking clear all to start fresh. Now, we can select what spells we want on our main bar. We recommend selecting personal defensives, offensives, and kicks on this page. Once your main bar has been created and filled out, we can go to the last tab called extra bars and enable the interrupt bar, which will automatically load all kicks. Here, you can also decide where to position the bar on your screen as it will anchor to your raid frames by default. Try to put it in a place where a quick glance is all it takes to find what you need. Finally, create an extra bar on bar one, navigate to the drop down menu on spell types, and deselect everything except crowd control and disarm, root, and silence. Once this is done, just scroll down and rename it to crowd controls so you don't get confused if you have to configure it in the future, and then drag it to the position you want on your screen. If you have any other spells you want to add, like health potions for the new season or trinkets that aren't in the add-on by default, you can find the spell ID on WoWhead and paste in the number in the URL in the spell editor. For example, to add Dreamwalker's healing potion, we navigate to the WoWhead page and paste in the number 207021. Following this, you can select the drop down to a consumable and put the cooldown to 300 seconds. And then go into your trinkets and consumables tab under spells and add it in so it will now appear next to all the other cooldowns you selected. Before you go, be sure to visit skillcap.com using the link below. We've been working with cutting edge players from Echo and Method to make some amazing courses available on our brand new Mythic Plus site. Here, you can learn the hidden secrets of your class as you discover tricks used by top players that allow you to maximize your DPS, healing, and survivability, while also learning some cool tips on how to use your utility, just like MDI and TGB caliber players. Right now, we are building courses for everyone, so if your class isn't represented today, be sure to check back later, where we plan to have most specs fully ready by the holidays. We're so confident our website works that we even offer a rating gain guarantee if you don't add at least 500 points to your IO score while using our guides. So what are you waiting for? Visit the links below to get started. And with that, we conclude our Omni CD guide for Mythic Plus in Dragonflight.